Californian autonomous cargo aircraft developer Natilis has successfully completed multiple flights of the subscale prototype of its 3.8-ton payload unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV. The flight tests for the Lacona short-haul UAV mark a significant milestone for Natilis by validating wind tunnel tests conducted over three years, testing the aerodynamic performance of the Natilis blended wing body, BWB, aircraft design. The subscale prototype of the domestic feeder aircraft took off from a private runway in Southern California and reached speeds of 70 miles per hour. Natilis said one of the key challenges with the BWB design has been stability, and the test flights validated that the Natilis configuration can fly without the help of a complex autopilot system. Natilis has also recently completed the full-scale prototypes of both vertical tails. The company will receive heart cell propellers in May, gearing up for the manufacture of the engine test stand. The 85-feet full-scale Kona demonstrator, the smallest of the Natilis fleet, will be the largest commercial air cargo drone targeted to fly in 2024. Kona will also help to open new markets for air cargo as the vehicle can land and take off on unpaved runways as short as 800 meters. The patent pending Diamond Cargo Bay allows Natilis to offer 60% more volume and lower flight costs by 60%. Natilis aircraft can hold a large configuration of standard pallets and outsized cargo without a contouring requirement. Natilis announced last month that the company has received total commitments to date for $6.8 billion for delivery of more than 460 aircraft. In December last year, Natilis partnered with engineering and manufacturing company Janiki for composite part design and fabrication for the Kona UAV prototype. In August 2022, Natilis selected Pratt & Whitney Canada to supply the engines for the Kona UAV. Natilis is also developing Eligio, a 60-ton payload medium or long-range UAV, and Nords, a 100-ton payload long-range UAV.